Greetings and salutations, everyone. I'm back. Hopefully, back to doing the usual things, a song and dance here. It's got a lot to talk about, I'm sure. I love this one. I also hate this one a lot. Get into that later. Destroy as many jammers in the valley as possible, and get that recon plane safely home. Radar won't work, so you'll need to find the airships visually and destroy them with your machine guns. Okay, so, as you can see, there's a bunch of dots. That's not necessarily where the enemy is at. You'll see a lot more of what's going on over there, but this is a time limit game, as it were, where we need to move quickly as possible. Gun down all the radar jammers. Oh yes, can be the F2A, can be the F15E. Do like, do like the F15E. I could buy it because I probably still have enough. Once the others show up, we'll go that route. See if we can buy some good weapons for it. While we're at it, the XMAA. Yes, indeed. Don't need the bomb. Just shoot it with missiles if it's on the ground. Yes. I already have large bombs. And not that I need either of these. Okay, so I have to score at least 1,300 points. It's harder than you think. It's harder than you think. Okay. So we're looking for blimps. This is the problem. They look like that. And you can see them. They don't take a lot. But... We have to manually find these, which is very difficult, especially when we're looking at the ground, because there's one right here. Like, you can, they don't move about, which is good news for us. But you have seven minutes to do so, if I get this correctly. And we have to be somewhere in that bar, right? This is a very unique mission. That you, even in the ace combat world, you don't see this too often where you need to rely purely on sight. The problem, of course, we have is that we have limited ammunition for our machine gun. I think on the very easiest settings you don't, but... Just one of those things. What I should have done was actually dusted the screen off. So I'd have a little bit easier time, because there's a couple of black spots as it were blocking my vision and when you're looking for basically black dots on your screen it gets a little crazy sometimes so the, one of the reasons why I hate this mission is it's actually very difficult to get oh no there's one in front of me it's very difficult to get a S rating on this mission. Like, don't be surprised if I just get an A, because you have to score, like, a very specific amount. Okay, we're going too far up that way. So you're gonna see me try to hug the ground as much as possible. I'm gonna try to hit it with a missile. It's difficult, because I can't track it, but you can just blind fire those guys. I don't need a lock on. It's not necessary. I think there's one there. This is very, like, this is one of the good things about playing on a widescreen format is that I have a little bit easier time trying to find these guys than I would if I were like on an, the old 4x3 CRTs. This is still a very difficult mission otherwise. As you can see, like, my actual, as far as staying with inside the noise jammer range, a little difficult sometimes. Right. I would like to find some more friends, if you don't mind. And the problem is, is that it's very... Like, it's very hard to get a good angle when you're looking around. Because the camera just likes to kind of just move in increments like those, but we found a bunch. Found a bunch. Okay, I see another one off towards that peak, too. 
Luckily, this is not the entire mission here. But it is the strong point of the mission here. Okay. I know we saw another one. I seem to have lost. No, I see one down there, so that's good news for me. I might actually hit that with the missile. I might actually do it. Yes! Such a good pilot. Alright. Now we're kind of on the outer edge, so we're gonna loop back. Start flying west as well. Because they're not gonna be anywhere north of us at this point. See another one. Good news for everybody. Nope. Alright, I might get that one. I would like some more friends. I would like some more friends. So they pretty much are nestled uh, like among the mountains as far as like height is concerned. So we want to stay lower to find them. This one's way out there. And I mean way out there. We'll take our small victories though. I meant to actually fire the machine gun, but, you know, habits die hard, as it were. Alright. I'm liking this. We're finding these pretty quickly. Alright. Just gonna fly with that formation there. I see another one. Oh, I think that's two we've seen now. Yeah, there's one in front of me and one just to the left. This takes a lot of concentration. And of course it's all about speed. Alright, this is good. This is good. We wanted a chain to, to find these guys. Now there's one I'm just passing. I have to leave a bee. More important that we get easily get the ones we want. Come on. Three miles, there. Down to a minute. I did see, yeah, I could see this one again. Probably go back to going west towards my right. I, unless there's just another one that's also chilling down here. I believe that they're all in the same spot, like you're never, like, trying to, uh, randomly guess where they're at. I was hoping we could find another one. We did get a good amount, though. Oh, Nally. Alright, I see one. I would like to get it. So if you hold the triangle, you get like that zoomed in view. Helps out quite a bit. I can't remember. I think I'm really close to getting the S rank. I don't think I've got it though. And they'll disappear. Mission update. Doesn't matter where I am on the map, those the targets will always come back. Like, they'll always be positioned where I'm at. Well, alright. Since they're deciding to be in a large... Large formation. We're gonna have to... Take our two little wins there. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. I've got a lot of missiles now. I've only used a couple on the blimps. Oh, come on. Chickening out already? Yep. I think I needed one more balloon to get that S rank. It's very, very difficult. It was not easy. I was worried that I was... I'm pretty certain I needed one more balloon and I would have had it. 
This is, like, it's definitely one of the more difficult missions to get an S rank. Just a ridiculous amount, because you need 1,300 just to pass. The recon plane brought back data but no, that was, that wasn't this good enough. Weapon designed by the to yeah, 23. Them. I think I need 24. Analysis by the intelligent unit leads to the conclusion that I had to skip through the, this war the text dialogue just so I could see how many I had. But yep, that is that. It's one of the better missions. But. But yep, there we go. Good to be back here doing some recording. Just was just was super busy, had to do a lot of cleaning and whatnot. And then, because my life doesn't get any better, the software that I've been using, OBS, decided to not function cor correctly. I got it eventually working, obviously, now. But now it's kind of me figuring out, trying to restore some of the settings back and figuring out uh, what I'm missing, what I'm forgetting. But hopefully next week we go back to, to normal schedule where everything's working just fine and we can talk a little bit about more what's happened. But it's good to be back. Sorry for that long departure. But that is going to be it for today. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time. Take care, everyone.